These are my top three things not to do when it comes to addressing invisible disability. Number one, do not assume that you know what someone needs. When I first started teaching, I never worked with students who had ADHD before. So there I am at the university meeting with the accessibility support specialist. She tells me, Anthony, you have several students who have ADHD in your classroom. And immediately in my mind, I had six or seven solutions already at hand that they could do. But before I even opened my mouth, she said, hold on a second. This is exactly what they need. And she spelled it out to me in detail with concrete steps that I needed to take as a professor to make sure that those students could participate on an equal basis with others. Number two, do not use a one size fits all approach. One size fits all fits none. Always go with one size fits one. As an entrepreneur, I'm always trying to think about how to get my products and services into the hands of more and more people. My knee jerk reaction is always to go to the vanilla, generic, bland, general solution. And so what I learned is whenever I'm being triggered by that idea that I need to just make it generic, I always go in the opposite direction. I make it even more specific, even more customized, and even more customizable. And number three, don't avoid conflicts when it comes to people with different needs and preferences. A lot of times what might help one person may make it harder on someone else. And so as someone who gets to speak in front of audiences of hundreds and thousands of people, I can't shake off the fact that some of my stories will hit with certain audiences and not with others. So after every one of my speeches, I talk to the people in the audience, especially the people who are hightailing to get out of the room, because it's those folks who can give me the most critical feedback. And what I, as a speaker and performer, need to know is what works for some and what doesn't work for others so I can tailor my content to serve the needs of as many people as possible.